Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, and we're here with episode 19 of Batman Arkham Origins. In the previous episode, we made our way over to the Gotham Royal Hotel um, after checking Electrocutioner's gloves, and uh, we went through a West Nightmare challenge and found where Joker and his assassins were meeting up. He killed Electrocutioner, and uh, we're basically making our way forward, hopefully to corner the Joker. And we left off, we're just about to fight off these peeps. Okay. I know I can mess with you. Hey, what the hell? Enough of the muck in the back, please. Boom. Okay. Dries. Dry stock. Dries. Knock knock, there we go. You can try, Joker. You can try. With that Titan formula, you don't stand a chance. Hmm. Not again. Please. Now this, this is what I like to call Joker Says. And right now, Joker Says, you're going to make this poor man scream his head off. If I try to pull him out, he'll be electrocuted. I'm going to have to play along. I think I smell bad brain burning. <laughs> when you were a kid, did you ever try burping? Was it? That was it. Honestly. I think the one little thing you need to work on is that sense of humor. You have inspired once tonight. And you know what they say. A smile a day keeps the reaper away. <laughs> I don't think that's the same dude, but sure. Hmm. Hang on. I can see something through there. Yeah, totally can. Can I... 
No, hang on. Ah, okay. Cool. Do it slide, come on. Okay, and there should be another one. Shoot it. So you get for working for the Joker. Why are you? Hang on. Sorry, I had the wrong face. There we go. I'll take that nose if you don't mind. Thank you. I think we're done in here then. Yep, looks like it. Ta-ta, farewell. Leaders and goodbye. Come on, where the hell is this pretty room? Give it to me. I demand you. Thought you could hide from us, sir. Huh? Well. <laughs> what can I say? Who are you? I'm here to help. There are more of them. They have my co-workers. They're, it's a bit like they're Holland, forcing them. It? Don't worry. I'll get to them before anything happens. Okay. Hurry. Hmm. Okay. Uh, right. Let's be okay in here. The bat ain't showing up. You all right if we ice these guys? Yeah. What the hell? Let's do this. He says we can kill him. Guys, look. I'm on TV. Hi, Ma. Hey, Vicky. Come here, baby. Get a shot of this. Go to work. Here I am. Oh, come on. What? Oh, that's... that's. Oh, okay. I keep forgetting that there's guys that uh, you're not supposed to attack. Pressing counter. Can you not do that, please? No! There are tons of guys you could have taken out there, and I want to take out the guys that are more likely to shoot me. He's going down, he's going down. And you. Ooh. The hostages are safe. I need to hurry to the penthouse. And stop the choker. Right. You're welcome, by the way. Honestly. It's 
thankless job. It's a thankless job. Right, okay. To the penthouse. Hmm. One, go. Quite the walk. Shortcut. Ho ho ho. Merry Christmas. Come on. Oh. Blood on the floor. Well, no, it's not, it's just carpet. Never mind. Blood covered carpet. Oh dear. Like this. Oh the dear. Set to detonate December 31st. I should be able to disarm them with my cryptographic sequencer. Oh, they're just so open about this. Around. Clock. Happy New. Oh, Happy New Year. No, come on. Thank you. Oh. Well, you just couldn't wait till New Year's, huh? Well, guess the fireworks are going up early. <laughs> yeah, you're a bastard. Superstitious. We're getting a ton of campaigns up here. Extreme threat. Ooh. 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 Sir, I've just seen the explosion at the Gotham Royal on the news. The hotel guests, are they safe? Not now, Alfred. Sir, are you all right? Your voice. I'm fine, Alfred. I've dealt with psychopaths before, but this... Sir, I strongly suggest you call in Captain Gordon. He could be a valuable ally for you. I don't need any allies. Okay, Batman. Whatever you say. I think we're here at last. Thank God for that. But remember, our primary objective is the bat. 
we must remain vigilant. So we cannot be seen. What we're gonna do. We can hope you're right. We're gonna do um. The bat is coming. Few. You have to kill all my men, vain brains. There's plenty of bat to go around. No storms, wind, ice. Wonder these people are taking doors. We got a great tip now first. We do a great, a batarang, a inverted, and a loud takedown. I believe. Right, come on. Can someone come down here, please? Pretty please. My reputation is on the line. Of course you can't. Okay, who feels like dishing? I mean, I've heard rumors about what happened in that library in Pinaduro. Anyone care to elaborate? <laughs> All I've seen this Joker do is talk and talk. No. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Another dude. Your son now, I think. Put me down! Close rank! Okay. That's three out of four done. That should be all of the takedowns. Yep. It just means we need to complete this now without anyone else taking us. I was going to turn around then. I must prepare myself for pain. We and that should be. <laughs> Come on. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Yes. Two in one. Beautiful. Oh, I'm chuffed. I am chuffed. Okay. Take an arrow with the Sonic Batarang. That should be... Yeah, we, we, we unlocked that as a reward of... Um, get challenged on... I am... Oh, wow. Fantastic. Uh, where is it? Um, yeah. That should be too big a deal. Uh, no, I don't want to look at upgrades. I want to look at the room. Um... Are we going? No, we'll be going out to ground floor, won't we? I'd have thought that would have taken me many attempts. Oh god, it first try. I am chuffed. Sp 
spare Sundown, surely. Please, not the head. Please, not head. Spare third. This is the most difficult part. Oh, there we go. Swash down. Thank you. Bloody Nora. I'll say it again. It's like bullet teeth. Going up. Drop in and just in time. Oh, he's my parasol. <laughs> Remember, you gave your word. You have one minute. Do they even have manners where he comes from? <laughs> you see. It's a tradition in my house to open one present each on Christmas Eve. Hmm. How about this one? <laughs> and a party in a pantry. How many lives did you just take? None, I think. That was just a little stocking stuffer. A construction site blocking my view. <laughs> but this one isn't. <laughs> Alright. We have a level up, but we're gonna beat the shit out of joke first. I've long waited for this moment. With your death, I will find peace. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for- oh. Hang on. Oh, your houses. I want an upgrade. Uh, we've done all the invisible ones we can do yet, so we're going on close combat again. Uh, double special combo move. Or should we do increase efficiency? We'll do increase efficiency for now because it'll probably work better against Bane. Oh, I present to you the death of the Batman! Let him. Okay. Oh, hey, whoa. I do. Oh, he's angry now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Titan. Hey, shocker. Oh, you are kidding me, dude. Oh. Hey, 
Where do you find out? I fancy change the scenery back. I've got him, Batman. Alfred. How do you make it as a good Alright, take two. Well, this section anyway. I see there is still some fight left. Now beat it out of him! is Dunzo. Goodbye. No, you don't. Oh, not again. Are you kidding me? You have no health left, dude. to it. Obviously he survives. We've got sequels to get it. Now why? 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 
Why would you do that? Newsflash! I'm the one who's trying to kill you! <laughs> Those were two very, very bad men. Ooh, the things they've done. You really don't want to know. They deserved death. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> Freeze! Don't move, freak! I think he's talking to you. Take him down! Let me guess. He got away. Take him to Blackgate. Where'd he go? Huh? The bat! The partner! <laughs> My partner? Who else would jump off a building to save your sorry ass? You know, officer! <laughs> Wondering the same thing myself. Okay, what the hell is going on? Playing as Joker now? Welcome to Blackgate. We're gonna do a quick psychiatric evaluation. Bad day, huh? That's Holly, isn't it? Sick and defenseless. Tell me something, dear. Have you ever had a really bad day? And what do you mean by that? You all people should know. There's nothing so cruel as memory. The pointy, biting through thunderbolts, unwanted party crashes, screaming through your synapses. <laughs> Inescapable, unrelenting, not at all friendly. You can't even escape into madness. <laughs> and then you meet someone who changes your life. And you feel that you don't even know who you are anymore. Isn't it funny how one little encounter can clean it won't, up it won't count it, I don't get it. past, deform your memories and persona until you rethink your whole identity. <laughs> and as you realize how foolish it all is, <laughs> your laughter reverberates off the walls of your own emptiness. Oh. I'm gonna need more specifics. How about we try some word association? That sounds delightful. Accepted. That's a little tried, isn't it? Look, <laughs> I'm only doing this to help you. Let's try this again. Acceptance. <laughs> My favorite stage. <laughs> okay, one more, and I need you to be serious for this one. Fate. <laughs> you want to know something funny? I used to think of fate as evil, predetermined not by some higher power, no, but by the rules of human nature. Tonight, it's all changed. What changed? Have you ever had the feeling that your entire life has been building towards this one moment? Is that how you feel? <laughs> well, now, yes. Now I realize that all the battles, the bad days, the brutalities, it was all the hand of fate at work. So now you see fate differently? <laughs> Absolutely. Now I understand there are no chances.
chance encounters. It was all meant to be. Everything leading up to who I've met tonight. So you've met someone special? Yes. And you might say it's changed everything. Everything? Absolutely. I mean, do you realize what a wild world we live in? How lonely it is to wade through all that wretched filth on your own? It is kind of lonely, isn't it? Of course. Of course you understand. Even in a crowd of other screwballs, <laughs> you're so alone that you can kick, claw, yell, scream at the top of your lungs. It's like you don't even exist. I feel... This is very trippy. And how does that make you feel? Drift, floating, like someone's pulled the stopper on my reality, and I'm sucked down the drain into something new. It's all very exciting, really. <laughs> you wouldn't know what that feels like, I'm sure. I might. Can you tell me more about how this person makes you feel? It's like meeting someone I can actually relate to. Which, believe me, dear, I've never felt before. <laughs> you understand. You're someone who's not afraid to let go and fall. <laughs> Free falling, and I didn't pack a shoot. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yes. Yes, I do. I figured you would. So, may I ask? Who is this person? Oh, someone very, very special. But whose real name I don't even know yet. Uh, my name's Halleen. Halleen Quinzel. What a pretty name. Do your friends call you Harley? Oh, uh, I don't have a lot of friends. Well, Harley, you got one now. Okay, okay. Why? Why? Why would you do that? We're still doing this. Come on, I've got to wrap up the episode, dude. Newsflash! I'm the one who's trying to kill you! Oh, we're going back to Thomas and Martha thing. anticlimactic, but I hoped you might finally be ready to celebrate Christmas Eve, now that the Joker's behind bars. Bane is still out there. I've got to locate the signal from the tracker I placed on him. Even you must eat, sir. If you hadn't called the police, he'd already be in custody. You know, I made a promise of my own to your parents. No sign of any cash. Not now, Alfred. Story back at the precinct. Why see that? Found bombs under the foundation. Some kind of hopped up freak. Must have been 400 pounds of muscle. Took six cops to gun that bastard down. Yeah, I saw the body in the morgue. Couldn't believe Sounds it. Sounds like this could be Bane or one of his men. If I hurry to the GCPD morgue, I can inspect the body and the autopsy report. Well, before you leave, I've run some tests on the compound you found at the steel mill. Looks like a match for your globular projectile for non-lethal restraint. You mean the glue grenade? Indeed. The resin has finished curing. It's at your workbench. 
Okay, fantastic. And uh, testing it here in the lab before you go. But I'm sure you won't listen to me. You never do. Well, Alfred could just be quiet for one second. Sorry, babes. Okay, so we'll be definitely getting that next time. Um, and I don't think we're going to have enough time to run through all of our usual business because we're getting really close to 40 minutes. So, uh, in the next episode, of course, is our next set of combat challenges. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And also, be sure to share the video. And I'll see you guys in episode 20. Bye, guys.